Hi, Jennifer with Mindful Movement, Mindful Living, and I am here today to talk about music, which is one of my favorite things. <laughs> uh, two things that I especially love to use music for are movement and mindfulness. Those are two reasons that I love music. Plus, I just love listening to it. <laughs> but, um, but as far as movement, uh, it just really helps. I think we've all had that probably experience where you're feeling a little sluggish and then you hear, you know, maybe a favorite song or something really upbeat and it kind of helps change your mindset and get you going a little bit more. It, um, it just really helps set the tone, you know, in your environment. So it can really help affect your mood and your energy. So I love it for that reason. Sometimes maybe if it's time, you know, if we're doing something for a long time, if I have to be working for, you know, kind of sitting still working on my computer for a while, it's just a nice way to sort of break things up. It's just to put some music on, you know, maybe with my kids, you know, just kind of get moving a little bit and then, you know, return back. So it's a nice little uh, way to, to kind of break things up and get you moving, which is really nice. Uh, in my classes, I have so much fun putting together playlists um, to go with what we're doing in class. So I really just think it, it really helps set the tone so much. And if you think about taking a class that is set to music and then taking the music away from that class, it's it's a big difference, right? <laughs> so it really is part of the, of the movement experience sometimes, right? Depending on what you're doing. It can be really a, an essential piece of, of setting the tone. So I love music as far as its impact on movement uh, and uh, to, to get you going. And then also on the other side of that, I think we probably all experience this too, where you're just feeling maybe a little wound up or wired and you it's time to sort of chill out. And music really helps with that as well. You know, just sort of switching gears um, from from the high speed lane to the low speed lane, music can really help with that when you need to make those shifts um, in, in either direction, really. So for today, I have a Valentine's Day playlist that I'm going to um, put up in a moment. And I have included both songs that are really uplifting, sort of faster songs uh, to get you moving. And then I also have included some more relaxing songs that are great if it's a, you're doing something a little bit more low key, if you want something in the background, if you're doing maybe some restorative movement or, or just kind of winding down, I have included some of those as well. Um, I've included songs from all different types of sort of decades and genres. So uh, hopefully there's some songs on there that you like. And I actually would love to hear from you what songs you love to, to listen to around Valentine's Day. Um, it's always fun to share that and, um, you know, and kind of see what other, what everyone else likes to listen to, get some ideas is always nice. Now, if you are following along with our monthly mindfulness challenge for February, which I hope you are because it's a really good one. Um, we are focusing on the intention of loving kindness this month, which is very appropriate for February or any time of year, but Valentine's Day week especially, right? So this playlist works really well for that as well because there's a lot of songs about loving kindness uh, that go with that theme in the playlist. It's also a playlist you could easily send to someone if you are looking to spread a little loving kindness. That's a pretty easy one to do. Um, so hopefully you can use that as well in our monthly mindfulness challenge. If you have not um, been doing the challenge and you'd like to, um, you can. I'll put a link to my last video where I spoke about that the challenge for this month or the intention really for this month it's not really a contest <laughs> so the uh the intention for this month i'll put a link to that if you'd like to jump on in and start um, focusing on that with us as well so i hope you have a wonderful valentine's day week i hope you enjoy this playlist and i'd love to hear from you on what songs you like to listen to as well for this time of year thanks so much